Hi guys, Wendy here. In this video, we're going to draw my Draw So Cute Giraffe. So let's get started. With this giraffe, we're going to first start by drawing the top of his head. So right here, I'm going to draw a curve. This is going to be just right at the top of his head. And I'm going to bring this curve down on both sides. So that's the shape we're aiming for, a nice curve. And then I'm going to bring it down for his head. So it's going to be a, a kind of a long um, head right here, the shape. So I'm just going to bring it down more. If you've been following me, I usually draw these kind of like a dumpling shape for the heads of the animals. And this is about the same thing, but it's just longer. So I'm going to keep coming around right here and start to curve it in. and connect it. So there, that's the shape. A little bit narrow at the top, widen out about right here for the cheeks and then connect it right there. And then from there, let's come in about, say right here, and I'm gonna give myself a point and we're gonna to start to draw a big curve that goes all the way to the other side for the muzzle area. So about, let's say right here where it starts to curve up. I'm going to go to the other side, so I kind of know where to end on the other side. And I'm going to come to the center, and see about right there, and I'm going to draw a curve. All the way around, oops, to the other side. So there, got my curve in. And so then from there, we can draw um, the eyes for this giraffe. So I'm going to come up right here towards the edge. I'm going to draw a circle, a nice size circle. And same thing on the other side. And so from there, I'm going to make them draw so cute eyes. So two small circles inside for highlights at an angle and a curved line at the bottom shade in the top. Hope you guys have been loving all my animal drawings lately. <laughs> Had a hedgehog, um, a wolf, now a giraffe. So please make sure to check out my um, how to draw cute animals playlist for all the animals that I have for Draw So Cute and the lines at the bottom. And so then from there, we're gonna give this giraffe some really nice long lashes because they have really beautiful lashes. So we can come up right here and just flick out a curve. And two, maybe three. <laughs> maybe a shorter one at the bottom. So same thing on the other side. Nice and long. They have the most beautiful eyes. <laughs> and then right here at the top, I'm just going to come up here and just draw a little curve to anchor my eyes. And then I'm going to come here towards this curve right here. I'm going to draw two ovals for the nostrils. So I'm about right here and right here. And then, of course, I'm going to give it a cute little smile right underneath. So it's just a nice big curve underneath and cap it off. Okay, so now to make it look like a giraffe, let's come about right here. Most forgot the ears and we're gonna pop out two ears. So right here, we draw a curve. It's gonna come slightly down and then bring it around. And then come back in here with a curve, a little bit thicker here, and then it's gonna taper as we go towards the pointed part. So let's do the same thing on the other side. I'm just going to give myself some points once again. And approximately how long, so about, won't be the same, but just try your best to get about the same. And connect it. And right here, once again, curve and bring it in. And so then, of course, the signature thing for a giraffe is the horns. So I'm gonna come up here and I'm gonna be drawing two lines. So to make it easier, you can just do the same thing on this side and draw a circle. For a 
cartoon giraffe. There. <laughs> and then of course you also gotta give him his spots, his pattern. So right here, however you like it, just give him a little bit of pattern. So I'm just gonna draw two curves like that. So hopefully now that looks like a giraffe. <laughs> okay, so now let's draw the body of this giraffe. So we're gonna give this long neck, so right in the center right here. I'm gonna be drawing a line down, nice and long. And I'm going to start to curve it out for the body. So I'm just gonna go step by step here on both sides, the same thing. And then I'm gonna to start to bring it around. So however long you want the neck to be, it's all up to you. So then about right here, this is gonna be the body part right here. I'm going to come about right here and draw a curve so I, to end the body part and then to start to draw the legs. So then from here, I'm going to start to bring this down on both sides. And then right here in the center, I'm going to start to draw my two angle lines to separate the legs. And then just continue this down all the way, however long you want your legs to be for this giraffe. And you're tapering as you go down. So it's getting thinner and thinner towards the bottom. And then about right here, I'll end it connect it right here and then I'm going to draw the hooves. So I'm just going to angle out a little bit and connect it. It's so nice and simple. And then uh, for the back legs right here, I'm going to come inside right here and draw. Just follow my front and I'm going to end it shorter, so about right here. And then for the back one. I'm going to come, same thing, just to make sure it ends at the same spot on the other side. I'm just going to pop one out right here. And give it a hoof. So I got my back legs in, and then now for the tail. So I'm going to pop out a tail right here. It's a nice long tail that kind of goes up, tapers, and then draw the tuft of hair at the end. Kind of like drawing a leaf for the tail. And so then to make this really look like a giraffe, you have to put the patterns in. So once again, I'm just going to come in here randomly, however you like it. But I'm definitely going to give it a heart, say about right here, because it is a draw so cute giraffe. <laughs> and you knew I had to put a heart, right? <laughs> so then I'm just going to come in here and randomly Put these little patterns inside, however you like it. There's no right or wrong way, and as many as you want. So I keep going. So maybe one here, and for the legs. Of course, our giraffe is outside. So I'm going to come about right here at the bottom and draw these tall grasses. So they're just like those grasses that I usually draw, but it's just, just bring it up higher. And that's about it for um, this cute little giraffe. I hope you find him very adorable and that you'll want to draw it. Thanks so much for watching. If you loved it, please give me a thumbs up and share it. And remember to subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.